Hello everyone, today we will be learning some essential interpolation techniques. For this tutorial, I will be using Blender Grease Pencil version 3.51. Interpolation plays a crucial role in 2D animation, particularly when it comes to adding in between frames between two keyframes. In order to achieve this, we will utilize the interpolation mode. Let's get started. Firstly, I will draw some circles in the 1st and 75th frames to make interpolations. I need to position my cursor between these two keyframes in the same drawing layer. Currently I am in the lines layer. You can go to the draw button here. So I am in the lines layer. You can go to the draw button above and select the interpolation sequence. This can be done in both the draw mode and the edit mode. But for this demonstration, we will use the draw mode interpolation method. As you can see, the interpolation creates a smooth transition between the frames. Now let's draw again and utilize the same technique. In the draw button and select the interpolation sequence. At first glance, you may not notice any difference. But there are some issues here. So we will now draw a circle from left to right while the rectangle will move from right to left. As a result, you can observe some subtle variations in shape. This imperfect interpolation is not what we expect. Here, both the circle and rectangle are drawn in the same direction, allowing the software to comprehend the geometry. Here I am drawing in the same direction. Now you can see some small changes in the shapes. I am utilizing the sculpt mode here. In the first frame I draw a circle and in the 75th frame I sculpt it into a rectangular shape. By selecting specific vertices and sculpting, we can achieve this transformation. Ok, now let's apply the interpolation method and see the results. Select the draw interpolation sequence. You can see the sculpt tool delivers the desired and expected outcome. It's important to note that uh, the Blender Grace Pencil software can accurately interpret the geometry, ensuring there are no unexpected changes. To further comprehend the capabilities of the interpolation tool, let's explore uh, additional drawings. Here I will demonstrate uh, drawing some simple shapes. I believe this looks good. Now let's position the image in the middle of the canvas. We will select certain strokes and apply the sculpting technique.
now let's focus on adding some in between frames to this animation yes that's perfectly done it's crucial to understand that when using the sculpt tool within the same layer the interpolation method works flawlessly for frame by frame 2d drawings make sure you are operating within the same layer and employing the frame by frame method we will discuss more about interpolation techniques and other applications in future tutorials thank you for watching your subscription means a lot to me Stay tuned for more.